Welcome back to the channel, Rogamon Army. The support has been unreal. I appreciate each and every one of you. Before we get into today's video, please, please, can you subscribe to my channel? Also hit the notification bell and you'll get updates for my videos. I'm gonna be posting them weekly. And yeah, I appreciate the support you have all shown so far. So uh, today we have a special unboxing. I found this Shining Legends Dark Rye box at Walmart. I'll show you guys here up close a little bit. I know it's pretty big for the camera. And we shall also show you the uh, receipt. I have it right here. We paid uh, $19.98 for it. You know, I actually got a few of them. But we're gonna be opening one today. Now Shining Legends is an amazing set from what I've seen. I really want them Shining Mew. I'm a huge Mew fan, like that's what I want out of it most so that's what we're gonna try to pull there's also a uh, secret rare Mewtwo like he's in a testing chamber thing which that would be an awesome pull too that's a really valuable card other than that I'm not really super familiar with the set because I like to be surprised when I first open it but let's look at this it comes with the dark ride promo card I think it's a promo we'll have to look we'll, open right. we'll get right into it here bear with me Pokemon always makes stuff so hard to open, but I guess that's a good thing. So if you can find these, we found these at, uh, I found it at Walmart. So usually Walmart or Target is going to be the one. We won't take this out right now, but we'll just like take a look at it. The Dark Rye. Oh, he's looking so good right now. And yeah, it is. It's not looking like, I don't know if it is a promo or not. I think it is, but yeah, it's a really good card. We'll just set him off to the side here. Take these out. We also have the huge card, Darkrai. He's seen the slider right out. Yeah, and he's just, mm, he's a huge boy. So I don't know, I don't really know if I collect these huge cards, you know, they're kind of cool. This one actually seems to be pretty centered. Usually they're not printed very well, but yeah, it's a pretty cool card. So what you get in there is those two cards and you basically get four sleeves. So I'm opening this one because I'm a huge Mew fan. They had two Mews on there. And that's why I got this pack. Um, here's the code card for you guys. But like I said, these have been showing up mainly at uh, Target and Walmart. Um, by third, uh, the vendors stock them. I don't know what days you have to find out from your Walmart. But yeah, let's get right into opening this Mew card. Mew pack. And I'm really excited. I have never opened this set, like I said before, ever. So I'm really excited to open it. I don't really know what the trick is. We're just gonna try. We'll show you the code card here at home. So I think it's one, two, three to the front for this. And I think the last one is gonna be the energy. Yeah, it is. And we already looked at it. It's fire, that's fine. But hope everyone's been doing good. I appreciate you coming back to my video. I appreciate the new supporters. And yeah, it's been amazing just to make these videos for you guys. We got Incineroar. It's usually in focus for you. Pokemon Catcher. So these are all new. I'm going to go through them a little slower because I've never actually seen too many of these. We got a Purloin. We got a Litten. We got a Voltorb. A Breloom. I love Breloom. And for the reverse, we have an Electrode. And for our first rare, wow, we got a Hollow Reshiram. That is a really cool card. I like that. He's a fire type in this one. That is super, and this time I did remember my Ultra Pro sleeve, so we're gonna sleeve them up real quick. Mm. So yeah, these sets right here, like they're still able to find, you're still able to find them at the store. Like they've been popping back up. Nice little Mewtwo pack art. So I'd recommend going to Walmart or Target trying to look for them in person because online they're just like, heavily the scalpers have gotten to them they're going to be charging an arm and a leg for the pack so i recommend going to the store plus it's awesome when you can always find them at the store anyway hmm, so we're going right in this totodile he's looking super sick we're going to show you this code card right there now uh if you, someone could comment have they been using the code cards because i'm not sure if anyone has i would like to know i'll keep posting them for sure for everyone uh leaf energy it is a dark. That's a cool dark energy, actually. I like them. 
and okay energy retrieval here we go we got a lipard we got a volcarona nice like i said that is my favorite pokemon we got another totodile we got a litten we got a purloin we got a, another Voltorb. He's showing up. Ooh, we got a Golette. That's been, ha! Reverse Stunfist. You like in the background? I got my Stunfist gang. We're going to add him right back to the pile back there. And for... Ooh, we got an Evelto. Wow. We got the Bacon Strip Pokemon. He's looking mighty tasty today. But nice, nice. Okay. That is two... Um, What do you call them? Legendaries, thank you. I know everyone was screaming it at home to me. <laughs> but we got two legendaries already in Hall of Form. That's awesome. That's awesome, man. We're going to add a uh, little Stunfist. We're going to add him in the middle there. You know, that is just the regular Stunfist, not the Galarian form. But okay, we're going to save the other new pack for last. And we're going to open up this Shining Legends pack it's featuring Genesect. Oh. Like I said, I am still going. Okay, this one's going to be a little problem. We'll open from the bottom. I am going for the Shining Mew. That is the main reason why I open these. But I do enjoy the artwork, and I want to open packs I've never opened before. That is the point of this channel. And, um, yeah, there's the code card for you guys. One, two, three to the front. We're going to go Leaf Energy. It is fighting. But yeah, the point of this channel is just to bring cool content. And uh, a lot of the stuff I want to open and show you guys is just stuff you can actually go to the store and purchase for yourself. And not have to spend an arm and a leg to start collecting. We got a nice little Bulbasaur. That's a cool card. He's looking really cute. And another gold let. We got a Kroganol. Nice. Totodile is actually a really awesome... Pokemon, Croconaut, and Feraligator 2 are really sick. Larvesta, very nice. Sophocles, I don't know if any of you played the game, but he was really annoying in the game, but that's a little cool card nonetheless. And for the final one, woo! So, I don't know, do you get hollows in every single one of these, maybe? I am not sure about that. Let me know down below in the comments, but nice. We got a hollow Raikou. He's looking very nice. So yeah, because I'm not sure. I didn't look up too much about these. I like to be informed and let you guys know, but being my first time opening these packs, I really wanted to go in uh, blind and just, you know, have fun, have that nostalgia for the first time. But I think it's almost looking like you get one in every box. Okay, the code card for you guys. One, two, three. We're going to go big uh, psychic energy for uh, our boy Mew. It is not. It is steel. Okay, we got an energy retrieval. We got Incineroar. There we go. We got Feraligator finally. That is a nice looking card. I'm surprised that's not a rare in the set. I guess it's all the legendary Pokemon. That would make sense why it's called Shining Legends. Voltorb. Golette. Ekins. Breloom. Ooh, Larvesta Reverse. And for the final one another bacon strip holographic bruh okay so uh it's looking like you do get a hollow in each one which is kind of nice either that or i just got really lucky i didn't get any of the secret ones or the, any shining pokemon but it's okay it's okay you know we come prepared to this channel so i actually have a couple more packs i want to open i also acquired these at walmart's they were just uh sitting there they weren't in any, any blister or anything they were just kind of sitting there in these empty packs and they were kind of just calling my name so i had to get them so we're going to open this uh ho, -Ho burning shadows first and uh please stay tuned i actually have another special surprise at the end of this video i think you guys will like it it's a very popular set right now and uh yeah just stay tuned and we'll open that at the end of the video there's the code card for you guys one, two, three, to the front. We're gonna say fire energy. It is fighting again. Not getting any fire today. Ooh, Solrock, nice. 
Escape Rope. Very cool. Gloom. Tynamo. Crab Brawler. Inkay. Ladyba. Caterpie. Wimpod. I actually really enjoy Wimpod, so we're going to put that one off to the side. And for my final one, it is a Slow King. Non holographic. He's still looking extra relaxed at the beach eating his coconuts. That is an awesome card. I like that. So now we have Unbroken Bonds. We haven't opened that one on the channel yet. Um, basically, the card you're looking for is the Charizard and Reshiram card from this set. That's what I want to try to pull as well. Specifically, the uh, Secret Hyper Rare one or whatever you want to call it, the rainbow one of them. That card is going for a lot of money. And yeah, we'd like to pull that. In this video, I kind of just wanted to show you a bunch of different sets, kind of, uh, and again, these are all sets that you can get. There is the code card for you guys. These are all sets that you can currently get at any uh, Target or Walmart, pretty much, or GameStop usually has them too, but we're gonna go Fire Energy. It is fighting again, okay. Must be a fighting energy kind of day. Chip Ice Axe, but yeah, you can find them at any Target or Walmart currently. They're about $4 a pack and up, depending on if you have to get the box or just single packs or blisters, you know. But yeah, be on the lookout for them because they're actually becoming pretty valuable sets and yeah, the Pokemon stock is only rising, so. You might want to get your hands on these now before they're too expensive. We got a whooper for the reverse. And for the final one, ooh, we got a hollow golem. Nice. That is actually a really cool card. I actually really like that one. That is sick. We're going to put him in the sleeve. So we haven't got any uh, crazy pulls yet in today's video, just regular hollows. But don't be alarmed. We have one more coming, and that is a Hidden Fates. Mewtwo Blister so these are actually I found this at Walmart Let's see if I can pull up the receipt here Yeah, it's right here. It is seven that one for seven ninety eight That is This pack right here. It's a third-party pack So basically they're just charging you extra for the five cards extra inside So I'm gonna guess those are like absolutely crap, but we're gonna see this is the first one I've opened, but I do have a lot more. So let me know in the comments what your favorite booster pack I opened in this video is so far. And uh, which ones you'd like to see me open in the future. But I'm going to guess there's going to be a lot of Hidden Fates. And I actually have quite a bit more boosters, so I would not mind opening those for you guys. Maybe we can get this video to 40 likes and I could do it next week. We'll just have to see. Let me know. So for these cards, yeah, they're probably just going to be like nothing. We got a Dratini, we got a Tentacruel. Yeah, they're just like random cards they put in there so they can charge you an extra five, three dollars. But hey, online these car, uh, these packs right here are going for $12 plus. So, you know, we paid A, we got a little bit of a deal. And this is my first time opening these. Now in this one, there is a ton of cards you wanna open. Obviously the big pull is the shiny Charizard. That is the big one. But there is so many Shining Pokemon and Shining Pokemon and Shiny versions and Shiny Full Arts in this one. It's crazy. I really don't know what the uh, order is for this one. So I'm just going to open it like I was a little kid, you know. Just straight up open straight into it. And we'll get to it. This is my first time ever opening this set. So this is actually really awesome. Let me get it in focus for you guys. Okay, we got the Voltorb. We got the Geo, dude. We got the Eevee, Clefairy. This set is looking super nice, and I know this is one of the most collectible sets. Oh, we got a Reverse Jesse and James. That is cool. We got a Weezing. We got a Water Energy. We got a Magmar. We got a Charmeleon. We got a Jinx. And yeah, that's it. I guess the rare for this one was the uh, Weezing. So yeah, we didn't pull anything out of this one, unfortunately. We got the reverse Jesse and James. That's pretty cool. No shiny Pokemon in this one. All right, guys. Well, the luck wasn't on my side today, but 
I hope I showed you some new packs, some new Pokemon stuff you can easily go to the store and obtain now and that are going to be really collectible sets and just really cool sets if you're like burned out from the new Sword and Shield sets or anything like that. But yeah, just let me know which one was your favorite set in the comments. The winner, I will actually open more of those on stream and hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you back next week. Just wanted to say thanks again for watching everybody. I'll be here weekly. You can check out my last two videos. They'll be over here somewhere. And yeah, welcome to the Rogamon Army. We're gonna pull them Zards.